The probability of, of a succession of financial crises uh, in Latin America, as we saw in the late 90s and early 2000s, is currently very low. And this is mainly for two reasons. First, uh, tail risk events, such as the breakup of the Eurozone or um, withdrawal of stimulus from uh, the Fed that will result in very high uh, interest rates uh, have been greatly reduced. Secondly, the region is a lot stronger today than it used to be uh, in the late 90s, mainly because it has a stronger international liquidity position, meaning that international reserves relative to short-term liabilities are currently uh, four times higher than they were in the late 1990s, and also because balance sheet exposure to foreign exchange uh, movements has also been greatly reduced relative to the late 90s. So the, the combination of reduced likelihood of tail risk events in the global economy with a stronger financial position make uh, the probability of experiencing a financial crisis in the region uh, very low.